Hey guys, it's time to do a battery drain test between the Beast versus Beast Samsung Galaxy S8 and the S8 Plus. So we have a 3500 milliamp hour battery on the Galaxy S8 Plus versus a 3000 milliamp hour battery on the S8. As you can see, both phones are charged up to 100%. This test will include four stages of hell. First will be the app usage. So I'll be using Instagram for full 60 minutes. Then we'll be doing some YouTube playback for two hours and then a gaming test for 60 minutes. And the final stage will include a 4K video recording till death. Both phones are set to 100% brightness and we have the same Wi-Fi network and other than that everything is disabled like Bluetooth and all that other source of connectivity. So going into Instagram, going to the search tab and this is where we're going to be starting the test here. Okay, three, two, one, go. And uh, for 60 minutes, we're going to use Instagram and after every 10 minutes, I will be refreshing the feed. So sit back, relax and enjoy the ride. All right guys, 60 minutes are done and uh, if we check out the battery percentage, the Samsung Galaxy S8 is on 87% while the Samsung Galaxy S8 Plus is on 88%. So just 1% difference, uh, they're really, really close but the S8 Plus is winning the game. Moving on to the next stage which is the YouTube playback of a video which is nearly two hours long. So just gonna quickly play it on both phones at the same time and I will be back after 120 minutes. Alright guys, the video playback has completed and let's check out the battery status. So uh, the Samsung Galaxy S8 Plus is on 66% while the S8 is on 64%. So I have to say both phones are doing a phenomenal job with the consistent display on video playback. Samsung really improved the battery performance on these two devices. I mean, they are absolute beast. On to the third stage, which is the gaming. So we have Asphalt 8 game on both devices. We're gonna play the same stage on both phones. Let's uh, go to season number one. And this gaming test will be done for full 60 minutes. Yeah. guys the third stage has been completed time to see the battery percentage and the galaxy s8 is on 50 percent while the galaxy s8 plus is on 53 percent so the s8 plus is now three percent ahead of the samsung galaxy s8 and uh, the temperature of both devices are quite normal i'm not experiencing any heat or anything like that so these two devices are truly insane like 60 minutes of gaming two hours of youtube 60 minutes of instagram like it's still 50 percent of juice is remaining like i can i can do all that stuff 
on this 50 person you know i can repeat that but uh we're gonna move towards the fourth stage and that is going to be the camera test let's fire up cameras here and recording 4k video as you can see it is capped to 10 minutes only on both devices so you can see that uh, so we're gonna be recording 4k footage on both phones for 60 minutes because i know they're gonna they're not gonna die easily so for 60 minutes we're gonna record 4k videos and even my iphone 6s is having some battery issues it's now nine person down and i have turned on the low power mode and the galaxies are just so so damn good when it comes to battery i guess i have to i have to invent a fifth stage of hell in this video if they're not gonna die we have to do that but let's see if they're gonna survive the 60 minute of 4k madness <laughs> Okay guys, it's been 60 minute plus 4K video recording madness and it's time to check out the battery percentage and look at that, the Galaxy S8 is down to 13% uh, versus the S8 Plus which is on 20% so that is a 7% increase on the S8 Plus so I could not, could not able to make these phones dead with the four stages of hell even with the 60 minute long 4K recording they are kept going, they are still going and uh, the S8 definitely is a really, really good phone battery-wise. It holds up really great against a 3500 million power Galaxy S8 Plus. A lot of people said that 3000 million power battery on the S8 is actually pretty small, but it is quite efficient. Okay, guys, since these phones are not dying, I've made a fifth stage of death. I will be doing gaming with the flash on, so uh, let's see if we go and launch the Asphalt 8 game again. As you can see, still in the memory. Great RAM management right there. I'm gonna replay this game and start off the test. And we're gonna play this game with the flash on until these two phones die. So, just gonna have them rest here so that you can see the flash is on. This is insane. This is insane level of battery usage I know in real life you're not gonna be doing that but then again I really want to see uh, what will happen can the S8 Plus make a comeback um, it can happen you know uh, maybe the S8 Plus will you know decline with the flash I don't know but yeah uh, we are waiting for the death of one of these phones so that we can crown the new winner Alright guys, the flash has turned off on the Samsung Galaxy S8 because the battery is too low. It is about to die. It is around 4% but it's still going on and that is why I had to turn off the flash on my Galaxy S8 Plus because it would have been, you know, unfair to this beast of a phone. So the battery here is currently 12%. So I am waiting for the S8 to die. 12 versus 4, we have a clear winner here but again, I'm just seeing that how much of a resilience the fight that has been left inside of the Galaxy S8 is still fighting back and it is amazing. We are closing in on six hours of consistent madness. I am truly, truly impressed by both phones. So let's see how long the S8 can take before it finally, finally gives up. Okay guys, finally the Galaxy S8 is dead. 
I'm just gonna stop the test and show you guys the battery percentage on the Galaxy S8 Plus, which is 7%. So the S8 Plus has won the test officially by 7%. The S8 took so much time. It fought like a warrior, even on 1%. The S8 refused to die. And wow, that was insanely long test. I've been recording this video since six hour plus time. Look at that. And the SA Plus is still on. And again, that was a pure, pure hardcore usage, nonstop gaming, YouTube, camera, app usage. It was insane. Even gaming with Flash, that was the fifth bonus death stage because these two phones completely uh, passed the four, uh, four death stages that I designed first, so I had to go with the fifth one. But the S8 Plus is our winner. Thank you so much for watching this video. Uh, the S8 and the S8 Plus, both phones are great when it comes to battery life. Uh, but uh, if you want the best, the very best, then the S8 Plus is the phone to go with. I will be comparing it to the Google Pixel XL and the LG G6. If you guys are interested in that, let me know in the comments below. And see you in the next one. Peace.